Hello guys, welcome to PMS Crypto YouTube channel. Um, here we talk about cryptocurrency, we talk about air jobs, we talk DeFi, we talk about NFTs and how to actually make money in cryptocurrency, right? So today we're going to be talking about Firechain uh, Testnet and how to like uh, explore the Firechain Testnet under so that you will be very uh, eligible for it, right? So um, on Twitter, I made a trade on how to actually register for the uh fire chain tested thunder right so here you can see the uh the thread and how to participate in crew tree right so but first um i'm gonna add the link to the tweets in the video description then on how to register right so after registration you just need to like go to a uh, chrome and download the fire chain wallet previously my trade the when the wallet was not yet on the chrome browser we just have to download it from um their own website and install it on the chrome but now you could easily like just download it from chrome right so um here is fire chain wallet um you can just download it from a uh, chrome uh, extension wallet extension store like chrome web stores so i'm just gonna add here uh add extension and yeah it's going to download to my laptop right now and i'm going i'm going to i'm going to create a wallet so you can see it here i'm just have to i'm just gonna i'm just going to pin it fire wallet so then now is to create a wallet right this is it create a new wallet name your wallet so i'm gonna name my wallet ems right i'm creating it now 12 random phrase this is your your normal seed phrase you could have to save it because it's very important at this point so i'm going to continue and these are all my seed phrase and stuff right so i'm going to base them on, on my notepad for easily easy uh, like a uh, reflection if i need it okay here we go so i'm gonna copy copy or come to my notes and uh paste all right so i think does it right oh shit okay copy all come to notes okay so i'm gonna continue and i'm gonna add the password a special character alphabets okay This means that you just have to put A, B, C, D, or any alphabet of your choice. Put a number, put a special character, right? Maybe dollar sign or anything. So that's just how to create the password. Then you click on continue and your wallet is created, right? Now we have a fire chain wallet address. So literally what we're going to do now here is um, we're going to get the faucet so to get the faucet um we have the native chain and the evm chain balance right the native chain is the fire chain it's also support the evm chain which is like the ethereum virtual machine chain which is the normal uh, metamax trust wallet we know but then on the native chain balance which is fire chain then it has its own wallet address so now what we're going to do now is copy the wallet address we to go to this facade now this is the facade right which enter the native chain facade and then 
we're going to copy the wallet address right you remember we caught we paste the wallet address here on the notepad right now this is the native address i'm going to copy it i'm going to go to the facade this link i'm going to add it in the video description so you could easily like reach out to it in case you want to use it i'm going to paste this here and i'm going to write 100 Gonna put nine max value exceeded. I put down five. Okay. Previously we were using four hundred. Right now I think a lot of people are asking for four sides and the when it went down. So I'm going to send it to the wallet. Now it has gone. So let's go and check if we have it in our wallet. So total balance is still showing zero. Okay. Now we have it. So what I'm going to do right now on the testnet, right, is uh, I'm going to transfer some of these funds in the wallet, in wallet transfer, right, from the native chain to EVM chain. And I'm also going to swap, right. So let's, when you click on transfer, the recipient, uh, this is the source chain, the native chain. I'm going to set it to another person's wallet. If I have someone else's wallet, I'll just put it here and it will go through. But if I want to swap, I'm going to like swap from here, from native to EVM. So I'm going to put two fire tokens. I'm sending it from the native chain balance to the EVM, which is the Ethereum virtual machine compatible uh, wallet. You can see the OX stuff now, but this is the native wallet, this is the five. All the fire chain wallet start with five, but the EVM will know it starts with OX. So I'm going to swap. You can see the estimated gas fee. Um, we'll confirm the transaction and we'll see. Yes, it's already gone. For we have two uh, fire tokens on the EVM chain, so we can also do transfer. To transfer, so. I'm going to use the first wallet address I had here, even though uh, it's nowhere we can't see. So I'm just going to like go to the wallet and paste the wallet to it. Send one fire token to the address, right? So this is it. Now that wallet now receive one fire token. And as, as well, I can also bridge back from EVM chain balance to the native chain balance, right? Okay. I've already sent it one minus one. So now let me bridge. Uh, let me move back from the EVM to the native. I'm going to put 1.1 and you see the, the fee is very, very small but the fee to move it is bigger right so i think the swap is complete is swap process your swap has been processed right so we say we have three in the native chain now we have 0 0.8 in the evm balance right so uh this is just the test net and uh can also also make a video on how to run notes of how to process becoming validator on fire chain but that is not going to be in this video, right? And our next video, we're going to be having that and other uh, more important videos like to help people, guide people, like explore most of these new blockchains, right? So guys, thank you so much for watching this. You can transfer to your friends who are in the same group chat or in the same community with you. Ask them for their fire wallets and use this to like send to them. So I think that will be that for now this on notification subscribe and not on notification for the youtube channel so that you get notified whenever we drop a new video right thank you so much for watching and to have a lovely